today, <laughs> tonight, I have some beanie hairstyles. I am coming at you live from a real life scenario of two day old hair and I just got done mowing, honey. I just got done mowing and weeding the yard, so we could use some dry shampoo, but since we're gonna plop a beanie over top, I'm not even gonna bother with dry shampoo. If you guys are like me and you use beanie hairstyles on days where you could use a little refresher and it's just kind of like a lazy day, that's what we've got going. I am full glam though because it's fall. I wanted to honor that with my eyes and my lips reflecting fall colors, so here we are. To get started, all you'll need are three hair ties. <laughs> My little pull through tool, which I have used before, which this is optional if you don't have it. Don't worry about it. And then a banana clip. And then beanies. So this one is like a waffle knit. It's like obnoxiously large. It's bigger than the typical um, size. I'm gonna use that for one. This for another. <laughs> it's like the black and white looks kind of charcoal gray on there this one <laughs> which I kind of Frankensteined this hat because the little fluff balls came from an Etsy shop I bought them with a different hat and it never fit my head right it always kind of hurt and I don't really have that big of a head so I sewed it on this beanie which is just a plain black Carhartt beanie let's get started I'm going to get started with the fluffiest beanie and pull my hair into a side pony a few inches down putting another ponytail and then just tightening that and kind of pancaking it out. You can use a texture spray here if you need to. And then just take a small piece of hair to hide the hair tie and use the pull through tool to cover it. And repeat the same step for as many renditions as your hair needs. And then we're just gonna plop that beanie over top to hide that first hair tie and that's the first one for look two i started it in just a plain ponytail you can see it's pretty thin so i'm going to show you how to make that look thicker by just adding a banana clip horizontally as you can see it kind of spreads that hair out so it's not all concentrated just within your ponytail if you have thick hair this may not be an issue but if you don't this is a huge hack so it just looks like you have a lot more hair under there and then I've also styled it with a braid. For the last look, I decided some pigtails, so part your hair wherever, and then go ahead and make this little bulb-like half pull-through. Wrap whatever hair you have around and tuck it in the back. So this works for if you have longer hair or if you have shorter hair, you just won't wrap it as many times. And then repeat on the other side, and this is super simple, super messy, and it always stays really well. So there are three super simple, easy to throw together beanie hairstyles. I've also got a different beanie hairstyle I did before, just one by itself, so I will link that here. If you guys wind up recreating it, I would love to see, so tag me at For the Dainty Days on Instagram. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye! Three hair ties. Um, that's two. That's tough.